I don't know about you, but crazy, embarrassing, mortifying situations that happen in real life to me are almost too ridiculous for a sitcom. Too sitcom for a yeah. sitcom. Yeah. For example, I was on a train once from Edinburgh to London and I went into the toilet, the train toilet, and I thought I'd closed the door and so I pulled down my trousers, my, my pants. And um, then it, the train did one of those sort of lurches and just as I was about to sit <laughs> and I fell through the door <laughs> uh, in front of the buffet queue. Oh, no. <laughs> See, my grandmother always taught me when you go to public toilets, you shouldn't sit on the toilet. You should tutty above. Just well, above. this is more for her because this oh. was the problem. Had I. I love more that you're blaming my grandmother. Your grandmother. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. her fault that I embarrassed myself on this train. No, because had I fully sat, I might have been able to grip to the side of the cubicle <laughs> when train lurched. However, oh. that was the problem. I was squatting slash hovering. Right. Squattering. <laughs> I was squabbering on toilet. Yes. And that was the downfall because then I didn't I couldn't get purchase <laughs> <laughs> on the side of the cubicle and fell through door. Hence the falling. But can you believe the buffet queue? Because in a sitcom you'd go, Well oh, that's ridiculous, as if the buffet queue were there. Well in my life they were there. <laughs> <laughs>